Shein. Round of applause. Yeah. What's good YouTube, it's your girl Michelle Hare and I'm back at it with another video. So in this video, we're actually gonna be doing a clothing haul. So this is going to be a Shein clothing haul. I know, the time has come. I've actually bought from there before, but I've never done my clothing haul. So this is gonna be my first time doing a Shein clothing haul. So I'm super excited to show you guys what I got. I got a lot of stuff. Um, I spent like a hundred and something dollars, like maybe like 150 and whatnot. I used the discount code. So anything that I can find for discounts or whatever will be down below in the description box. But before we get ahead of ourselves, let me just say, welcome to my channel. My name is Michelle. If this is your first time ever seeing my face, then I'm gonna need for you to smash that subscribe button and join my family. And if you're already part of the family, then welcome back fam. Welcome to another video. Now let's get into the good stuff. Okay, so like I was saying, I'll link any promo code that can possibly help you out with your order um, online. So anything and all the items are also gonna be listed down below. So let's just jump right into this video. So first, let's just start with what I'm wearing, which is just this off the shoulder um, ribbed top that ties in the front. You guys will see what this looks like. I really don't feel like getting up. So you guys will see what this looks like in the try on clip, which I'm probably gonna be filming the try on clip another day. So if I look a little different, that's the reason why. Um, so yeah, so this first is this top. I think it was like $15. Really nice quality. Like, yeah, I was shook. I was shook it, okay? I really thought that this was going to be like, I mean, I don't know. I knew Shein had some good stuff and they have some stuff that's a little mm, but this was one of the really good items that I can definitely see myself purchasing from Urban Outfitters. So the fact that I got it from Shein ah, and the quality is pretty good, so. Yeah, that's the first item. All of my items came in this really big box, so I hope you guys are excited to see what I got. So next is just this um, snake skin top. It's like a melanated snake, as you guys already know from my um, Pretty Little Thing haul. I love a melanated snake. They had a top like this on Pretty Little Thing, but then this color is way cuter than the snake print top that they had on Pretty Little Thing. It's oversized um, and just super cute. It's pretty good quality. You guys will see what this looks like on, but it's actually really cute and it's actually one of my favorite items that I got. This is the snake skin top. Um, I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like when it's pulled out of the shirt. It's very oversized, very cute. The color is just giving me life. I already worn this to school. Obviously I didn't wear it like this and this low, um, but I did wear it to school. If I was wearing it out, this is how it would look if I was wearing it out. And let me just back up so you guys can see the whole outfit. So as you guys can see, I have it styled with some ripped jeans that I got from Old Navy and yes they did come like this yes Old Navy does sell jeans like this and then I just have it with some boots um, some black booties and that is the fit very cute very comfortable definitely a great piece definitely looks like something you would get from Zara okay next piece I'm actually really disappointed that it did not fit me it's one of those things where I'm like should I just wait to see if this is gonna fit later on or should I just be realistic and return it right now which I think I'm gonna return, but it was this really cute jumpsuit. Let me unbutton one button because this is not looking cute and you guys are just not gonna see the vision. But um, if I have time, I'll try to insert the pictures, but don't mark my word, I'm just saying. If I have time so you guys can see what it's supposed to look like. But this is just, I think I'll insert the pictures for the ones that um, just didn't work out. So it's just this olive green jumpsuit, it has, these really cute tortoise shell um, buttons. And yeah, it's just a super cute boiler suit pretty much. Very cute. Um, it just ran a little small, so it did not work out, but the color is really cute. The fabric feels like a suede, like a soft suede. And it just, oh. and they also had it in a different color, like a mustard yellowish green, and that looked really cute as well. Next are two pairs of pants. 
here's the first one they're these super cute um brown white and black striped pants and i am just a trousers pants type of girl and these are just really cute like and it just looks really nice with my brown skin like it should pop in so it's just super cute um and very 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 comfortable like I knew I was gonna like it once I saw the reviews there was a lot of great reviews on this it has two drawstrings in the front and then it's just like cropped at the ankles pretty much and nice and tapered and very comfortable here are the pants yes sis they are so cute i love them and they are so comfortable as you guys can see i do kind of have big quads so it kind of emphasizes that but i think that's kind of cute i think it's kind of cute um and this is just what it looks like i mean i can turn around like i said i'm 5'2 and this is where it hits me next are like the same pants but in the black and white and you know I had to get both of them and these are super comfortable as well like these just look really nice like they're very comfortable very cute um I love them okay so here are the other pants the black and white pants I mean they're cute they cool or whatever they're the same exact pants but I feel like I like the way the other ones look on me just because they're bigger stripes I love striped pants or striped clothes in general I really have a thing for striped clothes um so I still really like these ones but I do prefer the other ones. And these are how this, these ones look with the same outfit. Oh my gosh, guys, say it ain't so. Wow, my makeup looks really good. I think we could agree on that. Next is just this snake print skirt. Super cute, very nice quality, super cute. It's a nice mini skirt. And it has like this little leather feel to it. Um, it is lined on the inside. So it's not like it's super thin. It's actually pretty good quality. Like this is actually really nice quality. I just thought this would be super cute for a night out. Okay guys, so this is the skirt. It's super cute. Um, I don't have any Spanx on or like anything underneath that can like really kind of smooth me out so this is just what it looks like it's very cute very comfortable and not too short as well next i just have this bodysuit it's just a black um tube top bodysuit and it does have a thong bottom and it also clips at the bottom so when you need to use the restroom you know you just do your thing and unbutton it and also i actually was surprised when i saw that it had this lining so that helps keep it up and from falling down so this is actually really good quality like she in round of applause yeah really nice okay you guys so here's the bodysuit here is the top of the bodysuit i do have it paired with some farley jeans from asos and then this relaxed trench coat from um forever 21 and then just some boots that I've been wearing this whole time. Um, super cute. I think this is an example of how I would wear it out if I was to grab dinner with my friends. And like say my friends don't want us to be super dressed up. I think this would be very appropriate. Or even to go to the movies or something. Super cute. This is an example of how you could rock it. And I'm sorry if it's loud in the background. Um, I do apologize. Wow, you guys, I did not realize how much stuff I got. I actually got a lot of stuff. Next is just this top. It's like this. Of course, it's going to throw the lighting off, but it's this white smocked top, like, comes in and then also has these sleeves. I just thought those would be super cute for the summertime. The quality is not the best. It's pretty thin. It's pretty see-through. I'm probably not going to be keeping this just because I am busty and this would look way better on someone who has a smaller chest. Um, This top is not for busty girls. So as you guys can see, it's just like hanging off of my chest. It's not cupping it. It's hanging off of it. <laughs> Uh, looks like it's about to just jump off of a parachute. I don't know. It's not cute. That was not funny. Um, it's, no, this is not cute. So next is this cropped top. And it is this plaid cropped top. And it just looks like this. It's like a blue and a green. It's very thin as you guys can see. Very, very thin. I think I also will be t returning this and it's just long sleeve. I thought this would just be cute with some high-waisted jeans on a night out but it just 
it's not doing it for me like that so I think I'll return it but again not that bad but it's just Nah, sis. <laughs> so here's the plaid top. I am wearing it with a bra that I actually received from a seller on Amazon. Um, she sent me this and she wanted me to review it and I absolutely love it. It's from a company named Beautifo and I will link it down below in the description if you are interested. It is a really nice, cute umbrellette for girls that are especially busty too. It looks really good on us. So not only like the itty bitty titty committee can enjoy cute bralettes but we can also too um like i said it is a very thin this top um not that much going for it cropped it does have a small pocket right there this is what it looks like to the side and here it is to the back and here it is to the back on the other side next we have this fendi print like inspired dress i didn't know that there wasn't gonna be like um an undergarment or like a lining on the inside so this does not have any lining on the inside it is a long sleeve just cute little fendi inspired dress um and you can wear like black undergarments so it can look like super cute i'm not sure if i want to keep this this is not really my style unless i do wear a black slip underneath um it was just cute because I actually been liking this geometric print and it really reminded me of Fendi and the fact that it was even chocolate like I've just been loving like chocolate like that is my mood I mean kind of but you know it's just super cute you know okay so next I know I've been doing way too much with the snake print but next is just this um one shoulder snake print top very cute like i can't wait to wear this out this is just gonna be so cute it's gonna be banging in the club girl so i can't wait to wear this out um and yeah it's just it feels so soft if you guys can feel this it feels a very soft it's like i don't know super cute very very cute i can't wait to wear this out so here is the top super cute very soft <laughs> Okay, that looks wrong, but it's very soft. Um, I love it. It's cute. I like it, and it's soft, and it feels good. And it fits nice. It's very comfortable. So next is just these le leather leggings, like some pleather leggings. Okay, you guys, this is like my third pair of like leather pants or leggings. Um, and I have one more pair coming in from uh, Boohoo. But does this stink? No, these don't smell, actually. I don't know if it's because they've been aired out because I took them out the bag. Um, these are cropped, so I wanted some cropped ones, but they're a little too cropped to me. They are high-waisted, and they're just they're just cute, but they're a little too cropped. So now I'm just like, oh, what do I do? Um, but this is them. They are a little tight. I have to, like, you know, jump up and down to get in them. Like, hey, damn, girl, girl, how you get all of that? I have to do a little dance and wiggle in them. Okay, yeah, so these leggings are even too short to wear with my Doc Martens. I was figuring that that would be something I could wear with them since they're cropped, but check them out, you guys. Damn, girl, how you get all of that? Is you talking to me? Yeah, you. I bet you had to jump up and down just to put them on. I bet you had to wiggle a little round just to put them on. Okay, so next I just got this pinafore um, dress, which is cute in theory it is very cute in theory um it's very stretchy and these straps are very long and does it have a pocket no pocket and it just wasn't what i was expecting i was expecting something more structured but this is very like you know like flimsy and whatnot so it's not really what i was looking for for a pinafore dress but it was very affordable so it's like maybe i should just keep it i don't know um it's cute but I wanted something very structured, like an overall type of dress, you know, and that's not what this is giving me. Here's the overalls. As you guys can see, I just paired it with a long sleeve black t-shirt that I got from my mom. Um, so this is the pinafore dress. It looks all right. It does have a pocket right here, which is a real pocket if you want to put keys or whatever. And like I said, it clings to your body. So luckily, your girl's been going to the gym and my stomach's on flat flat. But if my stomach wasn't on flat flat, you guys, you would be seeing it all. I kind of have it ruched up because I think it looks kind of better like that. It looks like from the side, from the front, the other side and the back 
So next is this shoulder, I mean, wow. So next is this sweater. Um, it's this fringe tassel top sweater. It's very thick, very nice quality, but definitely not what I was expecting. I'm pretty sure this was like one size fits all and one size cannot fit all in sweaters. Like it just, no. So because I'm pretty broad up here, which you guys probably can't tell right now, but I am pretty broad up here and it just does not look flattering at all so and the color wasn't what i was expecting this was looking more mustard i was thinking more camel but this is like a little bit more yellow orange um but it is nice quality this is what the shoulders look like and it's just cropped but honestly it's just not what i was expecting um i didn't like it on me that much i didn't think it was that flattering but as far as it goes for quality and for it being a sweater like i think this is really nice okay guys so when i first tried this on the very first time i got this i didn't like it but i think i had gained some weight during that time and since then i've lost some i don't know if that's what the scale says but that's what it looks like when i tried on the top's not horrible i do have it tucked in higher with these jeans that are from top shop the color is not what i wanted but it's not horrible this is just not a practical top like if you lift up your arms obviously this is going to roll up so it's definitely cute for like a picture at the pumpkin patch or something like that but it's not very practical so let me just back up so you guys can see what it looks like next we have this jumpsuit oh my gosh if you guys don't know i'm a jumpsuit i'm a pants type of chick like sometimes I will, i'll wear skirts and dresses but my comfort is in pants and jumpsuits and this is just something very comfortable to wear at home it is a v top well v neck type of jumpsuit and then in the bottom it just like is like that drop crotch type of Fit. it's super cute like I know you guys can't really see what's going on with it but it's very cute and very comfortable like I already know this is about to be my jam like I just love to be comfortable and mm, you already know I'm about to be so comfortable in this so um this is actually one of my favorite purchases as well and it has pockets it has pockets here this is what it looks like and this is just it with a cardigan. I got this cardigan, I believe, from Boohoo. And yeah, this is just what it looks like. Okay, next is this cropped jacket that I probably won't be keeping as well. Like, it's all right, but, and it would look nice on my skin tone, but again, just not what I was expecting. And the strings on this is actually very long, very, very long. I don't know why it's so long. Like, why would they even make it that long? I don't know, but um, yeah, it's all right. Walking around like the big yellow bus. Double touch bus. I'm about to play that song because that's what it makes me think. Like, when I see this, you guys are gonna hear the song that comes to my mind because I feel like I just walk around looking like a big yellow bus. Okay, so the little hair from the sweater I was wearing before is on my bandeau. So if you guys can see that, I do apologize. So this is the cropped jacket. The color is not that bad on camera, but to me it looks more of a mustard and I wanted something more like, you know, vibrant as a yellow. Let me show you guys the strings because you guys can see that the strings are very long as you guys can see the strings are super long um, which i don't get i believe this jacket was one size fits all or maybe it wasn't but it does run small so definitely go up a couple sizes and um, this is what it looks like it's just super cute this is what it looks like in the back let me just back up i just been wearing like pretty much the same bottoms and boots for all of my outfits just so I don't have to keep changing. But I would definitely probably wear this with sneakers, honestly. But it actually doesn't look bad like this either. As you guys can see, the strings are very long. Very, very long. Okay, so 
Okay, lastly, I'm just going to show you guys the accessories I got. So the first one is just this belt and it's a triple, it's a triple hole, whatever belt, triple circle, pretty much like the Gucci. And then you know how ASOS and Misguided had like the double um, one. And then I saw a triple and I was like, oh, I got to one up these hoes. And I got this one and it's super cute. The thing is it's not as big as I thought it would be. And I'm going to have to create my own belt loop. But, you know, it's it's cute though. Then the other accessories I got was just this key. I mean, um, what is this? I just lost my train of thought. Card holder. Which is, of course, snake print. It's like, I have to be stopped because this is actually starting to become an issue. When a trend becomes your life, like sis, chill. Next is just like a pack of earrings. This has hella earrings and I lose earrings a lot so I can't have the most expensive earrings because I'm gonna lose them, period. So um, I got this because I have hoops so I could put them in my helix and all of that. Just found out that's what a cartilage piercing is called. Shout out to Michelle. Um, but I could put it in my helix piercings and stuff like that. So yeah, that's just what this one was. That was a phone case. And when I saw it, I was like, oh sis, this is so cheap. I thought I was gonna get this extravagant looking marble case. I'm gonna show you guys the picture. And this is what the hell I got, a printed ass marble. This looks so bootleg. I am for sure returning this. I don't care if it was like $2, $4, $5. I'm returning this because this is bootleg, so bootleg. Okay guys, so that's it for this clothing haul. I hope you guys enjoyed all the pieces I got. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm definitely going to do another Shein haul. Like, most of these pieces were not bad. Like, I was actually really surprised. Shein, if you want to hit your girl up and do a collab, I would love to because I really liked a lot of the pieces. When I shop that website, I do make sure that I buy pieces that have pictures so I can see what it looks like on other customers before I make the purchase. Um, but returns are very easy. You just have to submit a ticket and then like print out the label or whatever it may be. So super easy to return. Um, but that's it for this video. If you comment down below what other hauls you would like to see. I mean, we ain't balling because we in college and we, you know, students, but I can see what I can make happen. But other than that, don't forget to tell your mom, your cousin, your auntie, your sister, your brother, and your brother's girlfriend to subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye, y'all. Love y'all.